hey guys and welcome back to another video and in today's video we are doing my update for my five dollars on every even number i mean even day of the month which you guys already know i decided to do it another way and my 52 week savings challenge and what i'm gonna be doing for may so just stay tuned for that one so what we're gonna start with we're gonna start with april so April, you guys already know, I did it as every even day, not $5 on every even day. So this week is $84, which is 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 2, 3, 4. That is $84. So let's see how much we have. all together just making sure all my bills are okay so we got 100 1 2 3 4 5 200 10 15 20 25 30 35 36 37 38 39 40 so we got 240 for the month of April, 240 guys. So I'm gonna pay here total 240. That is awesome. So I guess my, my way wasn't that much of a bad way. So I'm going to hit here 240. So you guys already know that I have here my March, now I have April, and that one is done. Now for my 52 week saving challenge, the number that I picked out from my little shaker was $50. And that is $50 that is going in here yeah guys awesome i just want to fix my bills okay so we have 50 and today i'm gonna pick the 30th because that's when I was supposed to do this video. And then I'm going to check off $50. So let's see how much we have now. We move that to the side. So 50, one, two, three, that's 60. Wait, I'm gonna do it my way to make it a little easier. So that's 100. So 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, that's 200. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. 2, 13. 2, 13 I have in here so far. Yes. 2, 13. I'm going to probably place that right here. 2, 13 as far as the total. So that's for my 52 week savings challenge. So we're going to put that here here now let's go on to may so today is may 1st yes and i'm putting out this video today today is may 1st so may's challenge is welcome to this month's cash envelope savings challenge the goal of this challenge is to save 20 dollars from any cash envelope every monday so i'm going to make sure i follow these rules here Use the calendar below to track the Mondays you need to save. So 4, 11, 18, 25. So that's that one. Then this one is another saving challenge. This one here I'm going to read off from my computer because I want I didn't want to waste too much paper to um, just to print out instructions, which... I didn't think uh, made sense for me to do. So it says the challenge you complete 
the water challenge. Here's how the challenge works. There's no spending at all on unnecessary flavored drinks, coffee, or liquor. If you like me, this if you like me, this challenge is beneficial in two ways, saving money and staying healthy. If you struggle with drinking water, this challenge will help. Avoid being tempted to buy a can of soda or a bottle of juice for the sake of it. Avoid trips to Starbucks, no matter what limit limited drink they are offering. No soda, no beer, no wine, no juice, etc. To make the challenge easier, make accepting a free drink within the rules. Doing the doing this pass, I found that it helps to have a dedicated water bottle for this challenge. Find a favorite or only use that for this challenge. So every bottle of water I drink, I have, well, every eight ounce cup of water I drink, I got a shade one, which I think is pretty cool. Hey, you drink some water. So this is awesome. This is going to be for May's challenge. So yeah, guys, so stay tuned for when I do my next update on this challenge, which will be the eighth. I'm going to try to do it every week or every two weeks, whichever way. You know, let me know in the comment section below. Would you want it every week or every two weeks? Because it's an every week thing. So let's see how we do it. But let me know in the comment section below which way you think is better that you guys will want to see it. So yeah, guys, so this is my update on my challenges and my new one for May. So yeah, guys, if you like these type of videos, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to share and subscribe and I'll be seeing everyone in my next video.